In this video, we are going to look at how to convert a fraction to a percentage and how to convert a percentage to a fraction. First, let's look at how to convert from a fraction to a percentage. Let's say we want to express the fraction 3 quarters as a percentage. There are two methods. Let's look at the first method. Here, I have a figure representing the fraction 3 quarters. I have four parts and three parts are shaded. Recall that percentage is out of 100 parts, so we need to further divide this figure into 100 parts. That means converting the fraction into an equivalent fraction with 100 in the denominator. To get from 4 to 100, we multiply by 25. So in the same way, we can multiply the numerator 3 by 25, and we get 75. So now we have the fraction 75 out of 100. And we can express this as a percentage, 75%. To do this conversion well, we need to remember the factors of 100. So remember that 100 is 1 times 100, 2 times 50, 4 times 25, 5 times 20, and 10 times 10. So with one of these numbers, 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, 20, 25, 50, and 100 appears in the denominator of the fraction, we can convert it easily into an equivalent fraction with 100 in the denominator. And from there, we can get the percentage. Now, let's look at method 2 to express the fraction 3 quarters as a percentage. Recall that 1 whole is equal to 100%. So, if we have 3 quarters of a whole, it is equal to 3 quarter times 100%. We can simplify this to get the answer 75%. Let's look at a more difficult example. Express the fraction 5 eighths as a percentage. If we use method 1, we need to convert the fraction into an equivalent fraction with 100 in the denominator. But the denominator in this case is 8 which is not a factor of 100. So what can we do? We can recall the fact that 8 times 125 equals to 1000. So we can convert 5 eighths into an equivalent fraction with 1000 in the denominator. That means we multiply the denominator and numerator by 125 to get the fraction 625 out of 1000. Now we can write this as a decimal 0 0.625. Then using what we have learned about converting a decimal to a percentage, we can move the decimal point two places to the right. And we get the answer, 62.5%. Let's look at using method two to express 5 eighths as a percentage. In method 2, 5 eighths of a whole is equal to 5 eighths times 100%. We can simplify this further to get 125 out of 2%. Then we can do long division to get the answer. And so we have the answer, 62.5%. Now, let's look at how to convert from a percentage to a fraction. Recall again that percent means out of 100 parts. So if we have the percentage 45%, this can be written as 45 out of 100. And then we can simplify this fraction by dividing the numerator and denominator by 5 to get 9 out of 20. This fraction is in the simplest form, so the answer is 9 out of 20.